take forever. You occasionally read a script and it just makes you stop in your tracks and you have to put it down and you have to gather yourself and this is definitely that kind of script. Just a deeply human, relatable story about a man who loves his son and is trying to do right by him in the last three months of his life. It's just deeply moving. So Nowhere Special, in its most simple form, is about a young 35-year-old man from, from Belfast who's a window cleaner who has dedicated his life to his, his son. The mother left when the kid was six months old and has, has gone and vanished. And when the kid is four, John, the father, finds out that he has a very aggressive form of brainstem cancer, untreatable, and has three months to live and decides to find a family through the help of some social workers and concurrent with that he is also trying to prepare his four-year-old son for death and, and, and some sort of understanding of what death is. It's dead. Why? The beetle's not really there anymore. It's just his body. This man has never been on a film set before until this job, and I would never say this to his face, but kind of brilliant. My real name is Daniel and my, my movie name is Michael. This is my first film. My favourite bit of eating lots of ice cream. Bruno Stein just fun. He does funny faces. James hurts me with my lines. I don't know it's very bossy. <laughs> he, sh he tried to at Mario's one time. You better not tell Bertle that. If I knew exactly what Daniel's magic was and could put it into words and replicate it, then I think I'd be sorted as an actor and as a human being. Oh, he's just an absolute joy. We're just going to wait there for a while. What was the nut? Roberto says that Daniel was one of the very, very first he saw and he kind of knew immediately. And Roberto was very keen that I should get to know him beforehand, so I came over to Belfast a couple of times and went to dinner with him and his family and went to play and we went to the park and we just got to know each other and hung out a lot. And in all of the time leading up to the movie and the whole time of the movie, and this is, you know, bearing in mind, it's a film set, it's stressful, it's tiring, you're in the rain, you're hungry, it's not glamorous as some people think it is. I've not seen Daniel shed one tear. I've not seen him lose his patience. I've not seen him really act like a child. He's just been a very mature but joyful presence. He can be bouncing around, playing, throwing sticks and balls, and then they call action and he just goes into himself and he centers and he finds Michael and he becomes this very thoughtful, quite somber child who's dealing with grief but doesn't quite understand it yet. It's amazing. It's, it's really inspirational. I've never had an experience like on a film set. It's been totally eye-opening and I've, I've loved it. What did you ask me yesterday? I don't know. You asked me who is a better actor, me or you. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And what was your answer? Me. <laughs> we see a young father and his four-year-old son navigating this incredibly heartbreaking and challenging time, but in doing so they find immense love and immense warmth and affection and moments of fun and moments of great tragedy and grief, but 
and ultimately it's a very human story which people will be able to relate to and hopefully it'll allow you to turn to your loved ones and put an arm around them and <laughs> give them a squeeze. <laughs> What can an audience expect when they come and see our movie? Better sad, some better happy. That's good. It's been an amazing shoot. It's been a total privilege. It's been a complete eye-opener for me to work with a four-year-old who is the future Marlon Brando. Do we want the audience to cry and laugh? And learn a little bit about life? Yes. Yeah? And enjoy the movie, mostly. Yes. And come and see it, that's what we need you to do. Yes. Come and see Daniel rock the world. Right, Daniel, say goodbye to everyone. And go and get bye some bye. ice cream. Right, say come and see our movie. Come and see our movie. Come and see our movie. Ah. Come and see our movie. <laughs>